So this is gonna be a uh, raw, probably really long, probably a really long video. And there's not gonna be any editing, so I'm gonna make mistakes. I'm sorry. Um, so I know it happened uh, maybe uh, two days ago. Uh, and you know what? It doesn't. Even, it's not even only about this one. Um. This happens all the time. It happens way too often. Sorry, it's a fucking plane. And I'm gonna use a lot of horrible language right now because I... I am... I've never been in a situation like that. Ever. And um, to think that people... Um, you know, school... Some high school is already shitty enough, um, but to go through something like hiding in a closet for how many hours or um, having to worry about maybe getting shot at school is so scary and frightening. And why does, why does that happen? Like, and you know what? I'll tell you why. Because of the fucking gun control. What the hell, America? N no offense. It's I know it's the stupid-ass law, and... What I don't get is some of you actually use this weird ass freaking logic that, oh, if I have a gun, that's gonna help save me or protect me from other guns. I mean, how about you all don't have guns? You know, how does, why, there's, <laughs> I don't think there should be a right for guns. You don't need a gun. Why do you need a gun? So more people can die? And some people can narrow it down to mental illness, okay? Yes, some people are sick in the head, okay? Some people are crazy. Some people just need help, okay? And it's not helping them by letting them be so... Guns are so easy to get, get a hand on, which, which, which doesn't make sense. Like, why? How is it, how is it that easy? And, and you all, so many wonder why there are so many shootings. You don't see Australia, New Zealand, Canada having that many shootings. And it's, it's because even if you are mentally ill or you need help, most, most suicides or mass shootings are all done in the moment of anger or um, sadness and they're not thinking clearly it's a button you just pull the trigger and you don't especially with semi-automatics i don't understand how people are getting their hands on semi-automatics are you fucking kidding me like all you need to do is be in that moment angry pissed off sad heartbroken like so just not with it at all and just pull the trigger and it does everything for you but i tell you that if they had knives or had to do this with their bare hands there'd be way less killings okay way less i actually i bet that most of them wouldn't even dare trying to kill people if they had to kill them with their bare hands i mean ever since guns Guns have been the problem most of the time. I mean, yes, it's still a problem that people are going through this stuff and, like, have that feeling that they need to kill someone or not. Like, most of them feel so, so guilty afterwards. And, and that kind of shows that it wasn't even their thinking. And, yes, I'm not saying, oh, what he did was wrong or whoever the, whoever anyone, you know, the killers are, I'm, I'm saying yes, they have something very wrong with them, and, but most of them are kids, all, the, all these school shootings, those, most of them are kids, and, and also they've been going through some shit, obviously, um, and they need help, okay, they need some mental help, okay, but, but I don't think they're only the ones to blame, they're not the only ones to blame, the law is to blame, the, the, the th authorities are to blame because why is it so easy for a kid or anyone for that matter to get their hands on a gun? There should be gun control. And so I'm saying go for gun control. And yes, my video might not do anything to the cause. And I am so thankful that someone or 
people are actually standing up for this cause and actually talking about fucking gun control for once. They're always pushing it aside under the rug and all that. And yes, I may not be American. Um, but I'm still a kid. I will... Young yeah, era, yeah, whatever you want to call me. But I don't care. It doesn't matter who I am, right? It doesn't matter. The, the, what matters is people are dying all the time. A bit too much lately, and that's why I don't read the news. I hate the fucking news. Because all of it is negative. And you don't hear about good things ever. Because apparently good things aren't that great. <laughs> because they aren't newsworthy. And I'm getting off the topic. I'm just, I just wanted to put my voice out there. I know I haven't been in a situation like this. And oh my god, I thank think whoever the high power is, okay? Um, that I don't have to worry about that. Um, that I'm lucky to not have to worry about that. But, I mean, there's so much bad in the world. And but then there's also so much good. Like all the students that are... Um, and also the community that is um, protesting and rallying and walking for the cause of gun control. And I, I am so proud um, that you guys are taking a stand, which is so important. Um, um, and I'm so sorry for all the, the lives that have... I'm sorry. I may not... I may not know how it feels to be in that situation. And I may never be in that situation. Um, but I have lost people I love too. Um, by unnatural causes, I guess you could say. Um, and I am so sorry for um, all of your loved ones and every, just every kid, um, that and person, um, I know some of them had um, sons and daughters and um, brothers and sisters and obviously families and and best friends and all that. And I am so deeply sorry. And I just I wish you guys all the best. Um, and I hope someone someone listens to you. Um, um, an authority figure. I don't know. Someone listens. And stops all the stupid craziness. And because just how has this not become a title? How has gun control not become a thing yet? I don't understand that. I don't understand that at all. And 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 it's not only America that has to speak up. I feel like the whole world needs to help out. Um, all everyone around the world. I feel like um, there's been not enough love in the world. You know, everyone's um, yeah. Well, that's America, so that's their problem. But it, how how does that make sense? I mean, by us just pushing it to side and saying, oh, that's their problem. That means how can you not feel guilty? Like you have to. I feel like everyone has to put. It, their part in it and, and try and help and do something about it. And maybe we can't do much, but at least we can voice what we feel. And, I don't know, help kids from not having to worry about getting shot at school. But more so, maybe bad grades. That's, like, that's the world I live in. And I'm so lucky for that. I'm so lucky. And I feel like that should be the world everyone lives in, okay? Um... That's all I wanted to say, but um, I I'm so um, I'm so sorry, and um, blessings and prayers and love to all of the families and and people who and the community who has lost, um, and you know the country and the world actually the world has lost such beautiful people. Um, I don't know that many of them personally um i don't know any of you guys but um i don't somehow i feel like i had to say something because i would feel guilty of not voicing opinion because i think this is such a tragedy and um lots of them were so young 
and it's so so small and I know I'm just 18 but no one no one deserves to die okay especially I mean at that young age it's just it's disgusting it's just it really rages me it it hurts and I know I call me whatever you want but um read about it and I was like I I can't read this because it's gonna I'm not gonna be able to sleep tonight but I had to say something I just I am um, I feel things I can see things that um and I may sound stupid when I say I feel your pain but I really can't feel Maybe not your pain exactly, what you're going through, what you had gone through. But I feel it. And and it hurts. And I feel like people have to stop um, giving, letting these problems take over people's lives. And, and just giving them away or shoving them away. And, and help people. And there's not enough help in the world nowadays. Like, and it's all about, oh, but that was mine. Or, um, that's their problem, not mine. And I think it's all of our problems because we've lost people and we're all connected in a way. We're, we should all be loving and helping one another. Another and, and there's so many beautiful people in the world too. Not just bad people. Or, um, not just pain. And for some reason, nowadays, all I can see in people is the pain. Or the sadness um, the tragedies, the, the killings, um, all these, um, hurricanes and the natural causes, well, or natural, I guess, depending on what you believe, right, um, and I just wanted to say that I'm sorry, and I know I probably, it's all been done, and nothing can, nothing you say can really change what happened, but hopefully it can change the future, and help Everyone, all the kids of America, and maybe kids later in other countries, um, to feel safer in their environment, not have to worry about killings or being killed today. Um, you know? Um, I'm sorry, I'm just so shaken up. And, and it is my problem, too, because only, only a few, only... Last year was I a high school student, um, and if it doesn't matter if I know you or not, it's just not right. It's just not right. I'm sorry, that's disgusting. But um, and I know it's weird to say I love you, but I think. Love is taken too seriously. <laughs> I mean, I love all of you. I love myself. Call me overconfident or whatever. But I love everyone. I love the world. And I don't want people to... I want people to be safe and feel safe in their world. And love one another again. And... <sighs> I just want people to love one another again and and help one another and, uh, and always remember to have hope and and I heard about some of the people um students and wanting to go back and fight and that when I read that I was if it's true and I mean, I would have, I want to go fight that cause too. I would have wanted to go fight or, I don't know, do something. And But that was just dangerous. And there's so much consequences, you just think, if you had gone and fight. And, and, and it's a beautiful cause. And maybe some of you guys will... You will grow up and be people that help people, you know? Like, I don't know, nurses and doctors and other things. Or just, I don't know, healers. I 
I'm just really sorry for all your losses. And, um, I hope you guys um, are safe and um, you guys will feel safe enough to not think about school and, and guns and, and all that one day. And just worry about your future and be kids. Just be kids. And just grow up and be safe. That's all I have to say. Well, um, yeah. Bye, guys. Have a great day. And, um, go, go for gun control.